so now let's see the next addition what is that is assembly informer or explored view so this uh, this module will give us the explored view of a particular cabinet so there are multiple ways to generate the explored view we'll go one by one so for example i'll take this one so before going into explored view double click this cabinet and in article management check whether this article option is enabled so then only we'll be able to generate the explored view so now click on the cabinet go to this option working cards click ok so to last to set the angle then click tick mark and then we'll get the automatic explored view this is the default explored view that the software is giving us so we cannot customize anything in this except the angle so this is the one way so the next way is we should go to print preview and go to prints and take a page for example take a print area i'll take an horizontal a4 sheet print area i'll again come back and next option is i'll select this particular cabinet again go to prints there is an option called as entities to print area so here since we have only one page so it is showing one page so if you are having multiple pages we can select the multiple pages here so it will ask the angle and the explored view is enabled and click send so we will get the explored view so we got the explored view now to do the labeling we can again go here there is an option called as automatic labeling so automatically the software will label all the parts so this is one way the other way is directly you can create a page here and clicking on this arrow mark the second option we will see all the cabinets in our project so for example we can select this particular cabinet you can see the preview here click insert element we can select the area in this case so you can see we got the area particular area is covered now we can go to automatic labeling we will do the labeling and the other thing is we may need the component list cutting list and hardware list so to insert those select this cabinet go to this assembly scheme and in this after selecting this you can first option is cutting list so you can place a cutting list here again we can place the component list component list will be according to the labeling done here so order labeling is done here the same labeling will be shown here and next one is finally hardware list so if you don't want automatic labeling the other option is you can click this and you can select particular panel and click on this option so you can place manually so this is other way so this is the way we create the explored view so in explored view now you can also change the textures for example if you are sending it to after creating a page in print preview for example i create a new page here i take a vertical a4 i'll come back to the project i'll select this cabinet go to prints here we have multiple options to insert the element so original colors or unique color or black and white so we have multiple options and uh, with texture so in explore view you can explore with following options and also we have automatic labeling so in explore view so if you are sending the print view we are labeling options like this automatic labeling so these are some ways we explore the cabinets with the details